Hey, what's up guys, it's JPGYT here, and I'm back with another YouTube video for you all today. In today's video, guys, I'm going to be teaching you how you can get to the AdFly link properly without actually installing a virus. So guys, on my new, on my Trevor Henderson add-on, I actually made it to where you have to go to the AdFly now. Um, now, you don't have to. You can either go directly to Mediafire, or you can support me by going through AdFly. And guys, if you, if most of you do this, then I'm going to teach you how you can get through AdFly. If you've been through AdFly before, and you know what the heck you're doing then you don't have to watch this video this is only for people who have never used adfly before like such as mobile users sometimes they don't have to use it and uh, sometimes they do but most people don't know how to use adfly so i'm going to teach you guys how you can use adfly without installing a virus and i've seen a lot of people complain about it's it just it's, it's just a virus so guys i want to make sure you don't install a virus um so guys i'm um, basically let's go ahead and show you guys what you can do so if you go through the, my website, if you like click on the website link on my MCPDO, it should send you to directly here. And guys, once you're here, you're going to want to click on the photo. And it will send you to the add-on. Well, not exactly. It'll send you through AdFly. Now, press block at first. You don't want to actually press allow, or else it might install a virus. I don't know why AdFly does this, but um, yeah, make sure you follow what I do. And never press download down here because it will just download this, which might be a virus. I don't know what Fire Player is, but it's obviously a virus. Now you're going to want to press skip ad. After you do that, close that link that was um, before there. Now press block. Block. And it will only do this three times. If it does it um, four, it shouldn't, it, shouldn't, it shouldn't do four. It should only do three or two. Um, so guys, as you can see... Um, this is the link. If, if you don't have, like, the automatic feature to actually do this, you're just going to want to copy and paste the link right there. And you should be good, and you just should go on a new tab and just paste it in here. So, guys, um, if you do have this feature um, for Windows 10, like, if you have it to work and automatically send you here, you're going to want to press download. Now, I'm not going to do this because I'm the owner of the add-on, so I don't really need to do that. It would be pointless for me because, like, I already have the file right here. So, guys, um, basically... I don't need to do this, but if you guys want to get it yourself, you're going to have to press download right here. And it won't do anything bad, so if I were to press this, as you can see, it just downloads the file. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Hopefully this helped you out a little bit. And, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.